You can change the name of your baloney if you want to. Okay. <laughs> I'll keep mine the same. Thank you very much. Welcome to the... What do we call this thing? The, uh... The Rock Ra Rager Show? We do a show sometimes, and this is it. Okay, so we haven't made one of these in a little while, and you may be in of wondering about... This is painfully awkward. Shh, no one will know. <laughs> we haven't made one of these things in a while, so it might be a little bumpy. Um, you, you may... What happens when you bump? So, you may be wondering, where have we been? Well, where have we been? Oh, you're going to ask me? Yeah. Right. Well, um, we've been here waiting on you. You see, in the past year, we've actually invented time travel. That's and right. we've been here in this for exact a year. spot. We waited right here this whole time in the rain, in the snow. We smell really in bad. In the blazing heat. But we're here now. We waited a whole year just for you. Now, the Kick Awesome show is back. It has come back from its walkabout. It's stronger. It's grown into a full-grown man show. <laughs> it's a full-grown man show now. So, good boy, little full-grown man show. So, we've done things in this past year. We've no, done we haven't. We haven't done anything. We've what done are you talking things. about? We've stuff. just We stood here for a year. We we've done stuff. That. We're doers of stuff. Stuff doing. Okay, fine. Okay. So what did we do? I, you tell me. Well. I may have had another child. <laughs> you know, you were there. <laughs> I've been tickling puppies. Legally changing the first name of my baloney. It is not O-S-C-A-R. Well, I invented time travel. Eating only hot wings for a whole year. I can never hear Johnny Cash's ring of fire the same way again. Down, down, <laughs> down in a burning ring of fire. <laughs> and it burns, burns, burns. We built an outhouse outside because... Um, we're revolting against the whole, you know, use your own indoor plumbing thing. But we also outfitted it with electricity and its own plumbing system that goes into a well so that we're not polluting the public water supply, only our own water supply. It's called recycling. You may have heard of it. I finally started wearing pants all day. I've been working on my Kristen Stewart constipation look. Does it look good? Convincing? Fantastic. You have to eat a lot of cheese. Actually, we... You remember that kid tastic thing we were talking about last year? Yeah, we kind of did that all year. And not this. All yeah, year. so it turns out when, when you, you make a, a video training membership thing and people pay you money and you have to make videos so they stay members, uh, it takes a lot of time and you don't have time to come out to the field and put your camera on a stick and have fun. Yeah, and but we did a lot of businessing and business learning and we learned other people to business. What? Not English. What? It's business. Okay, yeah, so we learned a lot. We're gonna keep doing Kicktastic, we really like it, but we missed you guys and we missed so having we're fun. Back. So we're back. We're gonna do to this. Kick off only in a field. Yes. With this kid practicing his soccer. All right. I owe you a lot of high fives for the last 52 weeks. So buckle up, Buttercup. Let's go. First is the Stem Citrus Fruit Juice Sprayer. That's right. This little plastic doohickey is jamming into your fruit. You can spray juice out of it. How does this work? I have no idea. But it's super cool. He's jamming in and you spray it. Well, that's it. My other high five this week is the Expedition Field Notes Explorer Handbook. Now, the Field Notes are awesome, but this one is really cool because it's completely waterproof. Just throw it in the shower, stick it under the water, and you can ride on it. But in order to do that, you need a pin that can do the same thing. And that's why they also sell the space pin. Why do they call it the space pin, you ask? Because you can write with it in space! In space, 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 space. Let me tell you a story. My brother-in-law was over at the house for Christmas, and I showed him this really cool thing that my wife had got me for Christmas, which was the Expedition Field Note and the Space Pen. 
And he was like, yeah, whatever. And he's like, if you stick that under the water and ride on it, I'll be impressed. Turns out he was impressed. My other high five this week is a really cool product called Idea Paint Clear. You've probably seen those paints that you can paint on a wall and it turns it into a whiteboard. So you don't have to go buy some massive whiteboardy thing. You could just take a wall and paint some white stuff on it. Instant dry erase whiteboard thing, right? Yeah, very cool. Okay, Idea Paint Clear is awesome because it is the same thing, but it's clear. <laughs> like you couldn't guess from the name, right? Yeah, so you could paint any color wall and then you could draw on it. So if you have like a bright orange wall or a super green wall or a purple wall, well, there's no wall, we're in the park. There's no, I'm just saying, if you had a wall in your office that was a crazy color, you could paint over it with this and then you could just take a dry erase and go at it. So to show you how this works, you remember Greg? <laughs> What's up, Greg? It's nice to see you. How you doing? Okay, that's that's good. I'm sorry to hear that. We'll talk about that later. Greg, I have prepared Greg's facade with Idea Paint Clear. I'm going to write you a message. Here we go. Ready? My high five for the past 52 weeks is a couple of things, and I'm going to tell you about them. So let's go. First, in lion or mountain lion, I can't remember which furry creature it is, probably one or the other. There's a thing you can do with paper, which is strange, because like it's computer, but it's paper. Have you ever gotten a contract from somebody or some other legal document or somebody just really wanting your autograph? You put on a legal document. If you have, you have to like print it out and sign it and then unprint it into the computer and send that to them, which is really sort of annoying. Because I hate paper. We know that I have a paper problem, so I try to stay away from it. But you can do this cool thing now, Lion, when it has like a little eyesight cam. You can take a pen and sign your name like you normally sign your name on stuff not on the internet. And then you show it to the computer in the eyesight thing and preview. And preview's like, sup, it's your signature. I know what to do with that now, dog. So then it does. And you got your signature and you can like digitally sign stuff inside of the computer without paper because paper <laughs> and there's another thing i was going to tell you about and it was space box now i know this sounds like a vessel and past our atmosphere but no 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 it's actually a different thing entirely do you like making money do you like making money online can i make that sound a little spammier space box is actually this cool thing where you can set up payments there's this guy, and he hated PayPal, like a lot of us do. He's like, screw this, man. There's got to be an easier way. So he made Stripe back in with his, his own front end and made it where you could set up payments like really, really easy. He called it Spacebox because his kid thought that was awesome, which is a perfectly valid way to name things. Good on you, man. But it just makes payments really easy. You just like, here's my product, send it an invoice, and hey, you get money. It's the greatest thing on the internet that I've seen in a while. It's pretty cool. I was going to say about something else too. You know what I was going to tell you about? I was going to tell you about this thing at the website. And on that website, you can have craftspeople make you things. Things from real people making real things. It's the new hotness. In fact, you'll want to get on this website and say, hey, craftspeople, I need a custom built Winnebago with dueling armchairs, one for each bag of Cool Rancher Doritos that I always have with me at all times. Can you make this for me? And they're like, shoot, yeah. Do you want it in mahogany or cherry? And you're like, oh, I didn't know I could have a choice. My dreams are fulfilled. And its website has a name. And from behind the camera, there's going to be a person that says the name of the website. Because I got magic. It's called Custom Made. It's Custom Made. That's right. Magical voice behind the camera. You get a raise. Thank you. Awesome. Here's the deal. We love you. You guys are awesome. How much do we love you? I'm gonna show you how much we love you. Are you ready? <laughs> Read it. It says two hairy guys in Tennessee love me. And you could have this on you, on your body. If you would like one of these to grace you, your body, then you may click the purchase link below and put them on you. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Hi, everybody. I love to be professional as myself 
or be as yourself. So don't forget to get me in this field if you need me. <laughs> I learned animation this time. <laughs> I love to work online as a professional be myself. My music pick this week is an old dude who's dead. His name is Django Reinhardt. He plays guitar, and it kind of reminds me of music that you would hear coming out of a small plastic rock at an amusement park, but I love it. I don't know why. It's Dollywood rock music. So good to work to. Yes. I don't know why, but I love this stuff. But he's not going to make any more albums because I told you he's dead already. Yeah, I experienced this last week, actually, and it's very pleasing to work to. Somewhat strange, but very pleasing. Yes. Pick. Are you done? You weren't going to tell him about how he has two fingers or anything? No, he's got all his fingers. He just burned some of them. Oh, okay. Never mind. Okay, just kidding. He plays with two fingers. Oh, okay, he only plays with oh, See, I told you there was a two finger thing. I listened to you. But he's got all of them. Okay, fair enough. Uh, yeah, so my music pick this week is Macklemore, The Heist. Actually, Macklemore and Ryan Lewis, The Heist. You like that? Yeah. So I'm not much of a, a rap hip hop kind of guy, uh, but I, I stumbled upon this dude and his crazy rap music, and I, I like it. It's, it's different, and the, the lyrics are mostly actually pretty intelligent, and he, he says some important things, which is rare among rappers. Uh, so yeah, and the music's really good too. Thrift stuff. Thrift, thrift. That's my favorite song. Thrift Shop. You've probably heard. That one's okay too. Pop some tags. Got twenty dollars in my pocket. Yeah, it's pretty good. Not as good as. That's the best one. That's my jam. That's yeah. We haven't done this in a really long time. We should stop. And that's it for this week's episode of the Kick Awesome Show. No more clapping and pointing. One more. Yeah, okay. All right. All right, we're done with this one. Yeah. We're back. We're a little rusty, so if it's a little jingly jangler than most jingles, give us some slack, man. It's been a while. It has been a while. It's been a whole year. Um, we're doing stuff this year. Yeah. And it's soon. If you want to come to the stuff that we're going to and see the stuff that we're going to see at this hurry. thing. You better hurry. And these things have names. They do. So the first one, Les Conf. You know, we always go to Les Conf. We always sing songs about Les Conf and do crazy things but we can't this year because it's the last year of LESCOM the last year ever so we're kind of sad Sorry. but we're also kind of happy that we're going to be there too and to see the final apparently epic send off um, we got paperwork in the email the other day about how we had to sign stuff in case we died and I don't really understand what that means but it's all inclusive all the meals all the transportation the lodging all that stuff is included in the price, and I still don't know who the speakers are because that's just how those guys roll. And there's another one called Converge Siege. And that's at the end of April, and there might... Are there tickets left for that? I am not entirely sure. If there are tickets, you should buy those tickets and come to that thing. I think the workshops are open, one of which uh, we are doing. Yeah, we are doing one of those, aren't yeah, we? Yeah, we're doing a, a business workshop about how to be more profitable in big and little things. All the stuff we've learned this year doing Kicktastic. Mm. So, um... Yes, you should sign up for a workshop and come see us and say hi. We'll give you a high five cook and a hug. Take a deep breath. You can make it. Here we go. We were gone for a year and we're sorry about that. We realized that we needed to do the Kick Awesome show, but we didn't know how. <sighs> no, we didn't. Because we were busy doing video businessing. That's right. And... It was great, and we learned all kinds of stuff, and we were teaching other people that stuff that we learned, and they liked it too, and they, they signed up, and we all loved it, and we're still doing it. So now the Kick Awesome Show is brought to you by the Kick Tastic. Kick Tastic. Kick Tastic. There's a lot of kickery. Yes, we like the word kick. Kicking. Yes. So we have to tell you a little bit about Kick Tastic before we wrap up, because that's just kind of what we have to do. What is it? Uh, it is video business training. What will it do for me? For unconventional businesses. It will help you learn to grow, market, run your business better, and have fun at the same time. Can I sign up for free? You can sign up for free and get weekly tips, video tips. Very nice. You can sign up monthly for a little bit more money and get access to all the videos. Or if you're just interested in our story of how we use this very show 
to make 50% more money last year, then there's a standalone product that will be available soon. I know you can't hold it in anymore. You're so excited. I can't. you That's That's great. Okay, so that's the Kick Awesome Show episode 40. Now, I know it's been a while, but you can still follow us on YouTube and Twitter and Facebook and any of those other places, Nate? Yeah? Okay, fair enough. So we'll see you next time, hopefully very soon. Kick Awesome Show. With a vengeance. Did you really just point to your back? And vengeance? This is the Internet's National. Ah, crap. <laughs> wow. That was. Okay. Show. Kick awesome. Hey! Show. Yeah. I can still get my leg that high, even after a year. Flexibility for the win. You're a flexible craft. And it came back to us. It stronger. Came, it came back stronger. Faster. Like a full grown man show. That still makes me laugh. It's a full grown man show. Actually, I spent most of the year growing a small furry animal on top of my head. It was like this, and I really wanted to show it to you. And then the thing happened, which we don't talk about, and it's gone. And so I fixed my hair like Nate's hair because Nate's hair is really how I live and and it's what is important to me is the spikiness in his hair and I hope to one day achieve the spikiness that Nate's hair gives to all of us and so that's what I did with my hair to stay in the rooms you get food yes Nate that's called sun I know it's weird we haven't been outside in a long time I think my flesh is burning right now my retinas hurt <clears throat>